I was inspired to do this story, uh, The Empress of Texas, by my visit to Miss Ima Hogg's home by a band in Houston, Texas. When I heard stories about a photograph that was found in the attic of um, Miss Ima and a handsome young man with inscription on the back, Fritz and me, and the fact that she lost her fiance in uh, World War I, I knew I had to make this film. When we wrote the script, our intention from the beginning was to tell the story of Miss Ima's early life and the struggles she faced. Love, loss, war, and finally her triumph as a grand lady of Texas, loved by so many. Her friends say she would be most discomforted by the title Empress, that she was a modest woman, but we decided to use it as to us and her many admirers. She was definitely a regal person. I think uh, soon that the world will love Miss Ima as much as we do. I, James Hall, in the name of and by the authority of the state of Texas, do solemnly swear that I will faithfully execute the duties of the office of governor of this state of Texas, and will, to the best of my ability, preserve and protect and defend the Constitution and laws of the United States and of this state, so help me God.
there's several years that are sort of a blank page that she never talked about in those three or four years. But she did have a boyfriend in World War I who was killed. And she went into a little bit of a depression after that and was treated in Philadelphia by a well-known psychiatrist there. I am against war. Fighting between two groups of one species is unnatural, popular only among men and ants. Hence ants know only of slavery and war. Wars seem profitable to the aggressor in power and spoils. The unfit survive. It is the fit who are sacrificed. We must think internationally. writer myself, I immediately responded to Ima Hogg's life when we uncovered letters and diaries that revealed her passionate anti-war attitudes and her determination to make life better for the less fortunate. We have done uh, a lot of research at the University of Texas and found a treasure trove of fascinating insight in her own words. Um, Empress of Texas will be inspiring film, beautiful, beautifully done. And uh, I think everyone will enjoy it and find something special for themselves. And the last thing I wanna say is um, that I'm just so, I mean, I'm so excited about this film and I'm determined to share it with the world.